Hello, here's Moon and I have yet another challenge lock here. This one is a lock jaw from Joe Pix. Joe Locks. Lock jaw, okay. Anyways, it's I opened quite a couple of times, but I kept playing with it because the feedback is quite distinctive and it was interesting just to take a guess what are the pins. So I guess I played around with it sufficiently, so let me just open it on camera and finally got it and check whether my guesses were correct. So let's get started. The back, pin 6 is binding, I think it's rated one, it usually gives a couple of clicks. Now 4 is binding, it's also something either serrated or a spool. Gives less clicks and clicks, but still. What do we have next? One spring. It might have a stronger spring. And it is kind of like teeping or something. Two. Don't know. Doesn't resist much. The number two and three. Okay. Three. Click of it. Now. Another small click of six. Check. What else? One. Still springy. And it might be still six. Yeah. Another click of six, and we have a false set. And here's uh, the spring from the padlock is still not in play, but there are spools and serrated inside, so I'm applying quite light tension. And I'm on five now, and I have counter rotation and a click. I think it might give another click in five. It should be something like spool with serrated top, I guess. Let's see what else do we have. One, yeah, click of one, but without counter rotation. Sometimes it feels like deeper false set when I do that, but not this time, not sure why. Let's see, six feels good, five. Five feels good, four. Well, three, three is too high and feels binding. All right, let me lighten tension. Click of four, uh, three, and it's open. That's a nice one. Let's see. Let's check the key. Didn't do it yet. Haven't looked at it. Well, I know the beating, of course, by now. But let's have a look. Some engraving on this side and that side. Look, Joe, Joe picks. Core was quite nice picture. Uh, not a core, of course, padlock body. Let's get this key. All right, hand filed key, very nice. Almost zero lift one, but not really. High two and three, four, five. Oh, and six is, six works off the tip of the key, I guess. Because it's, yeah, it must be tip of the key. All right, let's check the key quickly. works nicely. So let's cut it.
here comes the core or the, the cylinder whatever you call it nothing special here so let's get this clip off Hopefully. Come on. All right, let's do it a bit differently. Let's first turn it. And I don't know, use a tensioner or something to block it. Now it should come off. Yep. All right. That out of the way. Here is the key. Um, do I need a shim? Guess I'll do without. It was a bad idea. And now it's stuck somehow. And let me put it down. Here is one. Here is two. Keep in with serrations and I have lost one. Got it from the floor of my room. Use shims always. Do not skip it. All right, what should I do now? Then let's try without a follower. Here is a driver from five, uh, six, serrated. Five, spool with serrations. I was right, I guess. What now? Why doesn't, doesn't it want to come out? Springs. Wow. This is a gutting disaster. Another spring. Okay. What now? That's a handmade spoolish tip in pin three. Serrated in two. And it's like a chest pin spool with tip and top in one. And some more springs. I hope I still have two in the core in the body. Here is one that must be the first one that was strong. Where is one more spring? I 
have no idea. All right, I'll look for the last spring later and take out the remaining key pins. Serrated, standard, serrated. Now, the first one will be the longest one. And two and three, that will be three, and that will be two. I'm pretty sure I will find the spring, but for now, let's have another look at the core. Some nice threading with it. And the chambers, all of them. And I wonder we, why did he do that? Because, well, usually it's a better idea to file the pins in the core. But it worked. Nice feedback, nice challenge lock. Thank you very much for sending it my way. Let's have another look at the pins. Really nice serrations and that cannot be right. Wait a second. That goes here and this goes here. That's the way it was. Okay, that's pretty much it. Now I have to go look for the spring. Thank you for watching.